Hey, this is Travis at MudCreek.com. I'm doing a quick review of the, uh, it's both the Mossy Oak and the Allen brand. Uh, they're kind of made by the same people essentially, but uh, uh, caliper release. This is the large caliper release. And um, I've had this for several years now, probably five, six years plus. And I um, mean, it's just a cheap caliper release. I mean, it's, you know, right around 20 bucks. Um, and you really can't go wrong. You know, I, I'm, I'm a pretty big guy. I got big hands, long arms, and it's maybe just a tad small on me, but like it works just fine. And so I've never replaced it with a nicer one. Cause it's like, I really have no complaints over it. You know, it's starting to get a little bit, you know, I'll probably have to replace this here. I don't know in the next couple of years, maybe, but, uh, uh, the Velcro is starting to wear a little bit, which is going to happen with any any of them, you know, and you can see on me, it's just kind of barely, it doesn't get that far around on me, but it's still enough that, I mean, I've shot plenty with this and it, it works just fine, you know, and the, and the release is smooth. I honestly have no complaints with it and maybe it's just cause I don't use a nicer one. So I don't know the difference, but for me, I mean, you can see here, it just pops on, pops there and it's, uh, pretty strong you know I've, I haven't had any problems with it popping out anytime I pull back I mean this is a habit with anything I always just put my finger right there and just brace it just because you never know and I that's kind of like your safety if you will on any of these bows and I'd recommend doing that regardless um, of what brand you have but uh, so I just do that to make sure it stays shut but I've never had problems with it I mean you can see it it does just fine, but I'll do that. And then, uh, you know, when you want to release it, it's, it's a pretty hair trigger. I mean, it just barely takes anything to, to release it. You can see under tension there, you know, um, I'm not going to pull back the bow cause I'm doing this one hand a bit completely, but you get the general idea there. And it doesn't, I don't ever notice that noise when I do it, but, uh, um, Anyway, you kind of get the idea with that. Let me uh, pause this. I'm going to take this off and kind of just show you what it looks like. All right, so there it is. It's got um, kind of a camo-ish. You know, it's the old school camo. You know, like Vietnam-y camo looking stuff. Um, look to it. Uh, and it does have a little bit of flexibility right here. Not a ton, but a little. Uh, and then obviously that rotates. So it gives you a little rotation there. And like I said, it, for me, it's worked just fine. I mean, if you're an entry-level archery um, person that wants to get into this and you don't want to dump a bunch of money, you're just kind of a casual um, archer, then, you know, this will work just fine. I wouldn't hesitate to buy this at all. I think sometimes people get caught up and spend a ton of money to to buy things. So uh, just to show you, it kind of has this initial Velcro right here. And this is what's mostly uh, wearing the... Uh, the most here is and it attaches underneath there because this is not you know that's maybe one complaint I have is is that doesn't it's kind of worn as you can see and so it's supposed to hold there and in more than anything for me that's just to help me get it on and like you see it's it's already kind of coming apart here and but this is several years old now uh, and they haven't really changed the design much um, over that time and then this just goes up through here everything's harder one-handed goes up through here and it comes back around and just latches on and so obviously this would be underneath like this there you have it you know, but it um, it works just fine. Like I said, I honestly have uh, no complaints with it at all. And uh, it's worked well for me. So I wouldn't hesitate to use it at all. Anyway, like I said, it's the Allen and Mossy Oak brand uh, caliper release. This specific one's the Allen one, but the Mossy Oak looks just like it. So don't hesitate.